Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another release day unboxing and welcome to another unboxing for another Nintendo Switch game for this week. That's right, I, uh, I unboxed Puyo Puyo Tetris a couple days ago, which is a very fun game by the way. I might do a review for it, I'm not really sure. But now we have the return of my boy Mario. First Mario game on the Nintendo Switch, and it's a port of a game we've already had before with some new things and a and a $60 price tag, so that's the world we live in now, where we buy the same shit over and over again, except this time they added something that was supposed to be in the original, but it wasn't. And this is, of course, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, which I am excited to play, because even though it's not my favorite Mario Kart game, it's still a great Mario Kart game, so... And I've heard this one makes it, like, the most complete Mario Kart. I mean, the reason why I wanted this is because of the imp Not even... It new and improved battle mode isn't it just battle mode because that last battle mode for Mario Kart 8 regular for Wii U was not battle mode it was bullshit that's what it should have been called bullshit mode because that's what it was it was not battle mode it was a racing track where you just race and you have you battle I guess I, I don't I really don't get it like if you're if you're like way ahead your opponent then they'll never catch up so the, what's the point of this battle mode it's it was terrible it was so bad so now they put actual arena uh, maps and stuff for battle mode, and uh, they have the balloons, which they had the balloons before, but, you know, again, like I said, if you're way ahead of your opponent, he'll never catch you, so what's the point, I guess. Um, it, it, was, it, was a bad, uh, it was a bad mode, but this fixes that. So there's the front, very colorful box art, look at that, Rainbow Road, it's a road that you go. Here's the back, jump into the driver's seat, I read that backwards, okay, because through the camera thing viewfinder is that what you call it yeah whatever everything's backwards here you go what does it say on the back besides whatever I read with more tracks modes and features than ever before new faces to race with duke it out in a new and improved battle mode you get a feather and you get a boo as two different items and you hold two items at once for double the firepower so there you go damn straight uh what else uh, which was my favorite part about, what, Double Dash? Did they have that in the other ones? I can't remember. Um, I barely played the Wii 3DS and DS ones. Like, it's been a... Since Mario Kart 8... Between Mario Kart 8 and Double Dash, it was a very barren wasteland for me when it comes to Mario Kart games. Because I did not like any of those, really. I mean, I didn't hate them, but they weren't... They weren't my type of Mario Kart games, you know? But anyway, here you go. About three minutes in, now we're getting to the unboxing. That's usually how it goes. I'm sure I'll get this, like, because everybody's like, I just want to see the, the cartridge. I didn't even see it, Kyle. I want to see a stupid face, you stupid fuck. Ugh. Ugh, I'm just sweating and angry now. I, need, I don't have my knife here, so I'm just going to use whatever's sharp around me. All right. Oh, and here's the spine, by the way. Yeah, it has that shitty font. You know what? Actually, before I unbox this, let me just tell you about my life story. See, when I was a kid, uh, we didn't have video games because I was born in the early 1900s, and we had like ball and cup. And uh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. Ah, come on. All right. Boom, boom, boom. Puyo Puyo Tetris had a nice little background to theirs. Open this. What do we get? What is this? Was this just controls? What is this just shit? What a, what a, what a, okay, cool, I guess, play with your favorite control style, the stupid wheel, which I don't know what they call it now, the sweet, sweel, <laughs> the sweel, alright, I'm gonna get me the sweel, you can play with the, whatever, pretty much, you can play with a ball and cup, like I said earlier, you can play with that too, um, control guide, you know, it's not really, uh, the most intuitive controls, I mean, it is, I mean, no, it, it it's telling you how to play, it's just not, you know, like the A, B, then R and L, and that's pretty much it. And of course, the stick. Yeah, even my little kid nephew could probably figure that out. Here's the cartridge. Figure it out without stop zoom. Stop making my face. There you go. See, look at that. Oh no, it's getting blurry again. Yeah, there you go. Well, anyway, you saw it. It's just a box art, pretty much. Oh wait, hold on, I need to taste it. Let's see if this one tastes bad. Doesn't get better. <laughs> it doesn't get better. Alright, well, there you go. That was my Mario Kart 8. 
Hold on. I don't think it tastes as bad as some people say. Like, I saw some people reacting, and they're like, Oh my god! Eh. Just fucking... Come on. There you go. Done. So anyway, there you go. That's my unboxing for Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I, I like how more than half of this video wasn't even the unboxing. <laughs> but whatever. Anyway, there you go. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. And until next time, goodbye.